Hello everyone, welcome back to Taekwondo Step by Step. I'm Andrew. I was just joking about the, uh, the yawning bit just then, but it's so, it's so true with so many days that we suffer from insomnia. We just can't seem to get enough sleep. We can't even seem to go to sleep at all. And often it's because we work our minds so much, we're very mentally tired, but we're not physically tired. We neglect our bodies. So what we need to do is make sure we're physically tired and mentally tired and then we'll be able to go to sleep. So exercise. A good start today would be here with us on Taekwondo Step by Step. Let's join Master Lee now as he goes through a demonstration of Taekwondo Chiltang. Welcome back, Master Lee. Hi, everyone. I'm Lee Kyu-hyun. Andrew, did you practice yesterday's moves at home? Tell me the truth. Well, actually, Master Lee, I was a little bit busy yesterday. Oh, I'm disappointed at you, Andrew. You always tell the audience to practice hard. You haven't practiced what you preach, Andrew. You shouldn't be like that. Live up to your words next time, okay? All right. Now, as I always assure you, I will teach you as best as I can. You heard the man, he gets a bit scared if you don't practice, so make sure that you practice everything that we do today and uh, make the most of it. Let's go right now and watch him as he teaches us today's lesson. It's time for one step sparring. Now everyone, one of my concerns nowadays is that you might not be motivated with our sessions because they might look like the same kind of kicks but accuracy and agility can only be enhanced through repeated practice. Okay, same as before, the aramaki shows that the person is ready to attack. Until now, the counterpart went into a sparring stance on his right side to go into the defensive. This time, we'll change our stance from the right to the left. Now, when the opponent comes in for a chirigi, you bring your right foot toward you, like this, for the preparatory action. Let's try it. Balancing yourself firmly, you then swiftly spin and kick the opponent's face, like this. Then you return to the basic stance. This is a pammom dolyo hurigi on the face, kicking his face. Okay, this time in actual speed. Did you get that, everyone? It's now your chance to practice along with Andrew. Andrew? You wouldn't want to catch that one in the head, that's for sure. Well, that's probably the most difficult one that we've done this week, but it can come to you if you practice hard, so just practice. Let's go right now into our next section. It's another demonstration. Hello. 
the grace and the power of Taekwondo. It's all summed up now in our next corner, sparring. All right, now for the free sparring session. When you spar with someone, you can use these new maneuvers. Watch. When the opponent does a fainting move, you're likely to do a nerechagi or dolyochagi, and the opponent will likely do a composite move, a punch and a block. But there is another method. When the opponent comes in for the attack, you can initially avoid the kick by backing off sufficiently. And then, as he sets his foot down, you spin halfway and do a dolyochagi. You all know this is called dolgechagi, right? Okay, now let's try it again. We'll change roles this time. Watch. Do you get the hang of it? Did you get that at home? This can be an effective counterattack. Was that graceful and powerful enough for you? I hope so. I know what you're saying. It's just too short for you to catch everything that we've done. That's why we have our next section where we go from beginning to end. Everything that you learned today on today's Point. Medicine can only be good if it's got all of the right ingredients in it. So too, Taekwondo real life can only be good if it's got the next section included. Taekwondo real life. Okay, well I got just a little bit distracted there, but I'm back on my quest right now. Hello. Hi. What's your name? Sarah. Sarah. Well, Sarah, today is your lucky day because That's we are going to teach you how to take care of yourself. Does that sound like a good idea? It's very good. Well, Master Lee. When an assailant grabs your wrist like this, you follow along as he tugs you toward him. And then you grab his wrist with your free hand. Turning his wrist around, you break free from his grip and tilt his hand backwards. What do you think? No worries? No worries. Are you capable of doing that one, Sarah? Very capable. Okay, well, don't forget. We're going to practice now. So, together now in Taekwondo, real life. Oh, Sarah, this is looking pretty good. Master Lee, how does that look to you? Yes, she did that very well. Sarah, <laughs> you passed. Woo! Well, don't forget to watch the game tomorrow and you'll learn one more move. See you guys next time, okay? Bye. Well, unfortunately, it's that time of the day again when we must say goodbye. But, Masley, before we go, have you got something to tell us about how we can sleep better? Ah, uh, well, insomnia is prompted by either mental or biological reasons. But you can always get a good night's sleep if you work out regularly. They could be simple exercises. And even by practicing Taekwondo with us regularly, you can also sleep soundly. Okay, you heard the man. Join us again tomorrow for more here on Step by Step. Thank you, Master Lee. Thank you, everyone.